Hey guys, quick video on how to make a quick and easy and very cheap rinse kit like uh, project. So first you need one of these water cans, you can get any size. Um, this size, six gallon, got at Walmart for 17, 18 bucks, pretty cheap. Uh, the portable shower, it's an electric with a submersible pump that's down in the bottom. Um, it plugs into a normal cigarette lighter like that. Um, that I got off of Amazon. There's a bunch of different options, but this one was only like $19, so not too bad. Um, cut a hole in the top of the can. Uh, this hole is actually above where the vent is, so I never filled this jug up past that line anyway. Um, also allows me to fill up the cap without having to pull the pump out every time. A lot of guys go through the cap, but figure I'd do it this way. Just kind of sealed it up. It'll be fine. Um, it's going in my my 87 Volkswagen Weekender. It's not super watertight of a vehicle anyway, so I'm not not very worried about water getting in on it. But um, I got this size can because it fits nicely between the front seat, the back of the front seat, passenger side, and the back of the jumper seat. I don't know if you can see. It fits right in that slot can mount the, the shower head area up here. This is good for rinsing off surfboards, boogie boards, uh, all the kids feet from the beach <laughs> before we get in. Just trying to make the cleanup a little bit easier, but we want to use it. Just make sure I have water. Turn it on. You can hear the pump. Then the shower head itself right there has a little adjustable thing there. You can turn it on max. It's pretty good water flow for what it is. Um, you could take an actual shower with this, but we're just using it to rent up, rinse off gear and feet. Then you can close this off, turn off the pump, and then I can I just leave it unplugged while we're here. But uh, that's pretty much it. Super cheap, pretty easy. Um, once I got all the stuff, it took me like 10 minutes to put this together. So. If you're looking to do something like this, you want a rinse kit type thing, you have access to some 12 volt power, then this is probably the cheapest way you're going to do it. Um, I know some of the, the commercial products, they use pressure, you can pump them up and it'll hold the pressure without you, know, you having to use electricity. That's cool, but um, I intend on doing a solar panel on the roof of this guy and then putting a, a battery underneath the backseat bed there anyway, so uh, I should always have access to 12 volt power anyway. Um, and then if not, I can always take the cap off, use the spout here, and pour it to, to rinse people off and gear off as well. So that's an option if I need it. Um, let me know what you guys think, if you have any questions, concerns, um, or if you just want more videos on the on the Volkswagen, just let me know and I'll do some more. Thanks, guys.